Hello everybody, this is the Tesco from my blog zone. Today I will be teaching you how to set up your website to run on Cloudflare. Uh, as you know, Cloudflare is a uh, service that allows you to improve your performance and also give you added security. Um, it's really very, very easy and uh, all it takes is just a couple of steps. So what I'll do is I'll run by these uh, steps with you and I will assume that you've already gone to cloudflare.com and opened your account. So here we go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to transfer this website so, um, that I'm currently hosting at Bluehost. It's called Free, free Trial Software. I'm going to uh, use Cloudflare to speed this website up. So I'll just go and copy the URL. And in your Cloudflare dashboard, you have this part where it says to add your website. So let's just go ahead and add it there. You will have to remove the HTTP and no www so add your website now this time what Cloudflare is doing is you can see here it says that it's going to take 48 seconds well less now that it's scanning your DNS settings to automatically include every single setting you have on their system unless you have a very complicated DNS settings, this should be really, really, really easy to do, and um, as I said, it's done automatically. While that's going on, you can watch the video and you know, s wait until it's over. <laughs> there we have, so it's about 15 seconds left. Okay, we're almost done. And there we go. Now Cloudflare is asking you to continue on to step two. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so now we're on step two of four. And what Cloudflare did was it automatically extracted all your DNS settings from your existing uh, web host and basically you really don't have to do anything else because as I said if you have a simple DNS settings you should um, be okay so assuming everything's right all you have to do is just go and say that you're done checking your DNS records and click on that okay so step 3 or 4 uh, configuring Cloudflare now what these clouds are is that if it's orange what it means that everything that's happening on your website will go through Cloudflare so Cloudflare adds another A record which is you can see here it's a gray cloud uh, this is to ensure that you have access to your FTP uh, directly via your uh, web host so that won't go through Cloudflare so just to recap, if it's orange, it goes through Cloudflare. If it's not, then it goes directly to your web host. And you can obviously just click on this one here. Like, for example, you can, uh, you can say Cloudflare to enable or disable. In this case, you don't want to do anything with that. So moving on, everything's looking good. Click on the My Settings. Now what you have to do is just set your DNS settings. Cloudflare now is asking you to, to, to change your current settings, your current name servers, to a new name server. So copy that. Let's go to your register. As you can see right now, it's directing to Bluehost. So I will just put in on my name servers the first one. Let's go get that second one right there. Okay. 
enter your name service to save that. This should be easy if you have access to your register. All you have to do is just do that. Okay, so that's done. As you can see, my name service have been changed to the Cloudflare's DNS settings right now. So let's go back and tell Cloudflare that it's done. So let's click on that continue button. And there you go. It says congratulations. You've completed the setup for tri for free trial software.org. Um, one final thing that you would really want to do is that if you're on WordPress, you should install a WordPress plugin which is called Cloudflare. That allows you to to uh, whitelist your IP on your Bluehost so that everything flows in real smoothly. That's a also a really, really easy step. So let's go down here and see what happens. As you can see, Cloudflare is saying that it's already finished and it's just waiting for the name servers to change. Um, you can always check the details here, but while Cloudflare is doing that, let's just go ahead and install the plugin. So you're on your WordPress dashboard, dashboard this add new plugin, type in cloud, Cloudflare. Let's go search for that plugin. There you go. Install. And activate the plugin. That's it. You're you're done. Let's go back and check again. Refresh this website here just to see how it's going. All right. Free trial software.org is now with a check, a green check, meaning it's already powered by Cloudflare. See how easy that was? Very, very quick. Just to make sure the site's loading properly, just go ahead and refresh and see what goes. And bam, that was fast. Okay, thank you. This is another video tutorial from the Tesco iBlog Zone. Bye bye.